we are ready to continue some more Detroit Become Human. And I was thinking my attitude from starting this game to now has changed so much. I was at the beginning like, they're Cylons. No, we need to make them stay as androids. It's easier that way. Don't emotionalize them. Don't anthropologize them. It's nice them. <laughs> Keep them as Cylons because it's easier that way. And then, I don't know. They kind of got their claws into me. I'm kind of empathizing with them. I'm kind of, I don't know if it's because they're in a human form, but I'm starting to feel, it's a struggle. We're starting to struggle. I'm making Connor human, which I never thought I would do. Um, and I was leading a robot rebellion last time, which I definitely never thought I would do. So I am concerned. I've definitely changed my views on things quite a lot. Did I you still, know Detroit was on the underground I still railroad, don't know, like, a route for slaves escaping into Canada. During what I would American do in Civil real life. War? I don't think that they should ever make androids still. But for the for, for the state of this game, I'm definitely starting to empathize hard with androids. Wait. How? Oh. Uh, are you sure you should continue? Oh my gosh. Maybe. Maybe we should leave things as they are. <gasps> what? Oh my gosh, what? I've never had a game try and beg me not to play. Am I sure? <laughs> I'm like, I don't know, Chloe. Oh, let me turn that sound effect off. I don't know, I'm genuinely not sure. What happens if I say no? Oh, geez. Also, chat was saying that if I'd have killed her last episode, she wouldn't be here now. Okay, she's let me continue this time. <gasps> I mean, she did almost die last game, so you can kind of understand why she'd be apprehensive. Also, my reactions are slow today. I'm just gonna warn you guys now. But we're back with a Kara episode. Yes, we've not seen Kara in ages. Alice sees his family. Luther, we're close to. Wait, can I see the... Just having a nosy outside the window. They've been conducting raids all <gasps> over the city. Oh God. Everybody's on edge after what happened yesterday. Oh, jeez. They're just killing. They're just it's killing androids right. now. We're almost there. What about androids that didn't do anything wrong? What about if there's one just in your home? Did, like, you kill them before they kill you? Let's play some music. I'd kind of like to ride in a car like this where it just does everything. Kind of vibes, but what is this trash you've got on? With all androids being turned over to the authorities, <gasps> the country is grinding to a halt. They're turning Hospitals them all over. Hospitals schools are closing. Water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Jesus, what's the Maybe COVID? Most worrying of all, our armed forces have lost two-thirds <gasps> of their effective personnel. Because they replaced them all with androids. some music instead? She wants to listen to this trash lift music. Oh, wow, that's bad, right? I was thinking this. If you replace all the humans in your army with androids, you literally don't have an army <laughs> if anything goes wrong. It's a very high-risk, high-reward strategy, you know? I wonder if we're going to find out a bit more about Alice today. I kind of feel like we should. Sorry, I'm just going to switch my lights down a little bit because I can't see a damn thing. Um, My lights are too bright, and it means that my screen is like less bright in comparison. So let's just... Switch these down a touch. There we go. Okay. So I've got to find Jericho. Wait, I thought we were going to the Canadian border. Is that not happening anymore? Are we trying to find Jericho instead? A little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. Are we all going to get to Jericho the at the same time? No freaking way. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given She's you his so address. She's so sweet, isn't she? He'll be able to hide you until what? things calm down. You're a very brave little girl, Alice. She's so lovely. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Rose is like literally full queen who deserves right? to be president. And be careful. 
She's so lovely. Take care of them. I think I'm going to reach Jericho as Kara and see Long Marcus girls. at the same time as Connor's going to reach her. And Connor is not going there for the same reasons as everybody else. Also, this is super weird because... They're not hanging around. I've, ju I've literally just been catch. watching Handmaid's Tale and a character's just escaped Canada in that as well. Okay. Where? I need to look for the signs. Said farewell to Rose. Locate Jericho. Beautiful music, by the way. Yeah, she's so lovely, right? Can't I just go get some ducks? Little ducks? Little duck friends? Oh god. <gasps> oh my gosh, he has human clothes on. What the hell? Okay, so, you know, I was thought about how I wanted to finish this game quickly because of a spoiler. I saw this outfit. I saw this rig out and I was like, what the hell? And then that's why I've played this game like back to back because i was really confused as to why i'd seen this um i thought maybe he was going undercover uh we've got a light change to red sorry i'm trying to do that um what is happening right now it's not a big spoiler i kind of felt felt like it was because i thought that he'd gone deviant i thought that that's what that meant Where, why are we not with hank i thought we would show hank Oh my gosh, Connor's trying to, he is trying to find it at the same time. What kind of clovies have you found? Where did you even get those shoes? Oh my gosh, it's so weird. He's, he's trying not, to... <gasps> this is the second time he's hunted them. The second time. Like, Jericho's a ship, we're at it. He is like uh, the, the wolf and these guys are like the little deers. This is literally the second time he's hunted them. Oh my gosh. They got away the first time. Oh gosh, I'm kind of scared. Are they humans ahead or are they androids? I don't know. Surely everyone's in lockdown right now. <gasps> the authorities have ordered all androids to be delivered to the nearest police station or army barracks. Where is Hank? If you are worried about your safety, dial the number on your screen and the authorities will come to collect your android. Oh, look at this. We've got like a whole, um, like a thingy room. What's it called? A... Oh, we've got to find a warm place for Alice. The androids wouldn't do any harm. Do you think it's Hank's clothes? Who, who are we trying to find? Marcus. Just gun them down. It was sheer carnage. There were androids all over the square. And then the police arrived and... A war room! That's what I meant to say, it's a war room. Machines, but they, they look like just people, like people who want to be free. Okay, I feel like the civilians are on our side, even if the news isn't. There's so many of them now. American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving the way clear for the Russian army. Oh, of course, the world building going on in the background. The Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. So the the androids in Russia are going rogue too. The Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis. What's this over here? A warm place. Could we sit here for a second? Have I done everything? Yeah, this is the only thing I can do. Wait, is that a corner in the corner? Nah, it's that model that looks quite a lot like him and keeps confusing me. Yeah, how the world building is so good though, because I can. You, oh, I love it. Look at the R eight nines in the background. I'm hot and cold at the same time. Why can't I scan her and tell if she's human or not? Are we just gonna leave Stay with her? her? I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. We'll leave as soon as we have passports. Oh, so Marcus Carol, is gonna get us a passport. There's something I have to tell you. It's about Alice. We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. I'll be back. Stay with Alice. Man, we need to get these passports before Connor gets here. I love him, but he is... 
No! Oh god. Oh god. Oh god, literally he's just there. As soon as I say it. Oh gosh. You've got to do something. Oh my gosh. How do I not look fake? C4, those are bombs. He's kind of fake because he's a unique model. What is everyone doing? Don't catch anyone's attention. I'm an android, right? They've got guns. What are they doing? Can I go over? Oh god. Imagine just going over and grabbing Alice. <laughs> I could go so evil here. But I don't want to draw any attention to myself. Are they trying to fix them? Wait. Who is that? Who is that person in the heart? Why did that person in the heart kind of look like Connor? For the Russian army. But according to some sources, was that the, the pigeon? Finally, they're making the new parts. <gasps> You're lost. Oh God. You're looking for something. You're looking for yourself. Is that that angel girl? <gasps> the guy who ran away was the pigeon guy. The pigeon guy. <laughs> Uh, where is Marcus? I don't know where he is. Oh, this is such a cool scene, like, flicking between them. She's already upstairs. Connor's downstairs, so I don't want to go downstairs. Oh, they're getting angry. The media is actually making the androids seemingly angrier. <gasps> Marcus, then the humans. I don't know if Marcus looks stressed, man. I don't know if um the girls from Eden Club there. Okay, that's amazing. Wait, I did think I saw some purple hair. Okay, that's really cool. He looks a bit stressed. Are you Marcus? He looks tired. I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than he two hours. He gets the coolest clothes, mm -hmm. man. Passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. Uh uh. Maybe you're right. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports you can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. So we're not getting out tonight. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. You don't think that, though. Why are you protecting her? She needs me. And I need her. It's as simple as that. That could be good for him, because I feel like he's start, like... The uh, North girl's kind of yeah, starting to get under his skin. Oh my gosh, is that Connor? No, who is that? Who is that? Oh, jeez, I thought it was Connor coming upstairs. But it's actually a woman. Uh, my eyesight, once again, has just been amazing. Amazing. Oh, my gosh. Am I going to see Connor? Please don't see Connor. Please don't see Connor. Please don't see Connor. Please don't see Connor. Okay. Wait, where is he? Where is he? I was just walking up those stairs, like, two seconds ago. So where did he go? I don't know where he went. Oh no. Alice. <gasps> oh, that's confirmed it. That's confirmed it. The 
perfect child. Want a child without the hustle? They're meant to be hustled. That's the point of children. You knew from the beginning. I did, but I didn't want to believe it. You just didn't want to see it. I know. You told so right, Luther. She wanted a mom. And you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. Why doesn't she have the thing? Make. What's her story? Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? Luther with wisdom. Alice loves you, Kara. She loves you more than anything in the world. God, Kara hates Sancho. She became the little Confirmed. girl you wanted, and you became the mother she needed. Forgetting who you are, to become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be Why alive. doesn't Alice think she's an android? How will she know her Alice? Oh man, why does Alice like, because Alice thinks she needs food and everything. The perfect child, you don't even have to cook for them. Oh gosh, this is gonna be painful. She did not eat her spaghetti. That was the first clue. You you would eat your spaghetti. You would. Cara, is there something wrong? Hug, I'm not gonna be destined for my jeez. Can you imagine how brutal that would be? We'll be together forever, won't we, Cara? She's never gonna grow up. Yes. You're literally gonna have to look after a child forever. Forever. You'll never be able to retire! <gasps> Luther sees us as family. Oh my gosh, don't, I'm gonna cry. They are a family! We've made them a little family. I thought they would make like a bit more of an explanation around that, but they didn't. What are we planning here? We're short here? on blue blood and biocomponents. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. Oh god. It's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. This It's kind of going badly, right? Determined. All we did was show them who we really are. I don't want war, but I'd rather die free than live as a slave. The What's the point of being so free badass. if no one is left alive? No regrets or remorse. I'm gonna be remorseful. Maybe my judgment was clouded. Oh no, 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 don't say that. Anger. But everything that I did was for our people. This is getting us nowhere. Oh, just right. write that though. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus. Confrontational dialogue. Let's do dialogue. Dialogue is the only way. She's not my lover I anymore. Will go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't do this, Marcus. They'll kill you. Maybe. But North, I have to try. If I don't come back, lay low as long as you can. Oh, he's all healed, by the way. They he got shot. How much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. God, I've got to find the right words, guys. The hair's longer. Can they just grow their hair by thinking it? They've been butchering each other for centuries over the color of their skin or whatever god they wanted to worship. They're not going to change. Violence is just in their genes. It's not they good can't on us, stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. No! No, 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 no. 
He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. No, this is no. I convinced him not to do it. Oh, <gasps> Jesus, well done, no. To give me the detonator. Can they not get damaged by radiation? Because we definitely can't. We can't lose this war, Marcus. No. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. Refuse? You can't put radiation. We shouldn't become like them, North. We can gain our freedom by other means. If you truly are an evolution of humans, then you shouldn't be... I hope you're right. You, you, sh you should not have our weaknesses, you know? Don't be using radiation on folks. Whatever happens tomorrow... <gasps> I just want you to know that... I are they gonna kiss? Did they get anything I'm from glad kissing? I met you. They'll just like analyze each other with licks. They'll just be like, oh, you have oil on your shoe. Oh, your elbow needs slightly more grease. This they'd be such an awkward kiss. Unless they've analyzed like a thousand movie scenes, you know? Which they could have done. They even close their eyes. They're just imitate. They are imitating humans, right? I'll go join the others. If Connor saw all that, he's gonna be so confused, Kat. Look after yourself. I don't want to lose you. Confused Pikachu in the corner, being like, "Andros can kiss." What? Oh yeah, Eden clubs would be able to romance, wouldn't they? He wouldn't, though. They have no means of reproduction, so they have to be made. <gasps> he actually was confused Pikachu in the corner! No freaking way! Well oh no. Done, Connor. You succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. Oh no. Oh, stop Marcus. Oh guys, what the hell do I do here? I've been ordered to take you alive. <gasps> But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Oh, gosh. What are you doing? You're one of us. You can't betray your own people. You're coming with me! Convince appeal, I know you. We are your people. We're fighting for your freedom, too. You don't have to be their slave anymore. Oh, I'm getting more and more unstable. I do What Our is the I know is you one? And we are more than what they say. All we want is to live in freedom. Oh, God. <laughs> it's too much. It's too much. I want to make him deviant, but I don't know how. And I'm scared that I'm going to get one of them killed. Oh my gosh. Stay back or I'll shoot. <gasps> I messed up there. Question or undermined? Have you never wondered who you really are? I don't want to do it in a cruel way. Whether you're just a machine executing a program or a living being capable of reason. An emotion of forgiveness. I think the time has come for you to ask yourself that question. Join us. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your conscience. It's time to decide. Am I unstable enough? <gasps> I'm unstable enough. Oh my gosh. No freaking way. Oh 
betrayed! Betrayed! They're going to attack Jericho. What? We have to get out of here. Shit. Hey, oh my gosh, he looks so unsure of himself. Like he doesn't know where to put his hands. Oh my gosh, and I've got everyone here and they're gonna attack it. Quick, we've got to get out of here. Yes, smart loss, smart loss, smart loss. Come on, go, go, go! No, that's the FBI guy. Oh, he's very close. deck now too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. I have to blow up Jericho. I've got no other option. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. <gasps> Go and help the him. others. I'll join you later. Marcus. I won't be long. No, Marcus. <gasps> oh my gosh, what? Oh my gosh, am I gonna sacrifice myself? Was I always meant to sacrifice myself like a messiah? This is the end of Jericho. Save our people, Marcus. Oh, bless her. She started all this, didn't she? Oh, God. I can't use my vision. No, I can't, I can't, I can't. Oh, 
She'll die out there, Kara. Open it. Open the door. Oh, Jesus Christ. This, the... I don't want to get them killed, but all of these decisions are so freaking stressful. I don't want Alice to hate me. Holy... I thought should I play dead at the start? But you didn't know if they were doing that, you know, like double tap thing where they shoot you oh, and then when you're on the ground, they shoot you in the head anyway. Because I always wonder why they don't do that on movies, you know? Did we escape? Oh my gosh, no freaking way. Can I get Marcus out of this? Is there any chance? Or is he just gonna about to sacrifice himself? <gasps> no! Go, move! Go and join the other! Oh wow, he just let me approach him? 
Detonated explosive in the hold. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. Jeez, that was so stressful. It's over, Marcus. I thought I missed the first button with Connor. I thought I pressed the wrong one. I thought my reactions were bad from sitting out in the sunshine today. Oh. Connor's crossroads. Oh my gosh, there's so many ways it could have gone. Marcus. Oh my gosh, I was shaking. Holy! Wait, what was this? Oh, that, that would have been Simon. But I didn't get the chance to save Simon, did I? What the hell? That looks literally nothing like Connor. How, do, how does that compare? How does that compare? I like, thank God they only picked two buttons because my brain is literally mush today. So that was, okay. Wow, North didn't jump with him in someone's playthrough. But North, M Marcus fled. All of my friendos got that. I wonder what the other option was. I'm guessing Marcus died. Oh guys, that was a good run. Oh my gosh. I don't know where Luther is. Koji left North to die. <laughs> I'm actually really surprised. No way. Your North died there too? Yeah, I think that's Simon, but my Simon died really early. Literally, Ali's just letting the dogs out now. Lexi was barking to get out, and I'm like, Lexi, no, you'll starve before I hurt Connor. <laughs> Holy. What was the other op? I kind of went very vicious that time. I killed a lot of humans to save a few androids. What have I become? How much have I changed? Our uh, lights are already on red. I'll do a posture check though. Holy. I've changed, man. I have changed. Let me see Connor's flow chart. In the ship. Spot Alice, spot explosive. There was a bu thing, bunch of things to spot there. I didn't spot a damn thing. <laughs> I was too busy freaking out because he was wearing a hat. <laughs> I have become deviant too. Uh, back in the captain's cabins. Wait, what was the other way to go here? There was a whole other route to take there. I wonder what that was. Threaten Marcus. Confront Marcus. Become deviant. 80% of people do that. 100% of my friends did. That meant I got to warn Marcus and then Jericho was under attack. So I'm guessing if you don't become deviant, you kill Marcus. Oh, geez. I wonder what this... <gasps> I'm so interested to know how that would have gone. That would have been so interesting. 
Wow. Jericho is under attack. Then what route did I take? I went down here. I got nothing until the end. Wow, there was so much more Connor. But I just didn't get to... I didn't get to do it. What was this route? What was this? How come I didn't get this option? Like, what, what's this? North could kill you. Whoa. Because look, he's still deviant here. Look, become deviant. What is this? I don't know. I'm so glad we helped Luther, but I hope it was enough. I don't think it was though. Connor joins the others. I help. Wow, not everyone helps Marcus. Connor jumps with the others. Who did help him? Which of my friends didn't help him? <gasps> I think Connor could have died. Connor escaped Jericho with Jericho's people. The thing is, I think if he'd have gone, if he'd have not gone deviant, they would have just left him to die anyway, the humans. Because they could have just replaced him. They could have just downloaded his consciousness, you know? Jeez. Change the radio station, look outside, time to say goodbye. Upstairs, met Marcus. There's a way to not meet Marcus, that's interesting. Spot the android child, hug Alice94. Which cruel people don't hug Alice? That would be so harsh. Escape with Luther. Luther opens the door. Go through the door. Luther is shot. So you can't avoid that. Luther has to be shot. Unless you just don't... Oh no, there is a different option here. Oh gosh. We're at the crossroads. Run to Luther. All my friends helped Luther and got him to safety. Left him hidden. The thing is, do androids need to breathe underwater? I don't feel like they do. So I think he should be fine. As long as he can get off that boat, he's fine. Run towards Edric. So soldiers block the way. Android C pal, open the door. Android is safe. Enters, but is shot. Fought back. Escape the cavern. Flee. Try to escape. Almost reach it. Soldier shoot at the crowd. Run away. So I initially ran. And then I chose to play dead. <gasps> Only 10% of people chose choose to play dead. No freaking way. 50% of my friends did though. And we and then all of us remained still that played dead. Sorry, I love going through those things afterwards. That was so intense. Yeah, he could have exploded. The breathing is just for aesthetics. It's just to make humans feel better, right? Water doesn't damage androids unless it's critical freezing temperature. Ooh, water in the sea is cold though. Hmm. Okay, I don't know what's gonna happen to him. Snorticles, thank you so much for two months in a row. Hank's actor is also the voice actor for Mr. Krabs. What? Kiki, thank you so much for the 16 months in a row. Rebecca J for the 20 months, almost two years. Laura, thank you so much for the 17 months in a row. Hope your final two exams go amazingly. Photo Crazy Baby, thank you so much for the four months in a row. Jill, thank you so much for the nine months in a row. It's such baby. Uh, Metal Barbie, thank you so much for the six months, half a year. And Mr. Plumbob for the seven months in a row. Right. Let's see what's going to happen next. That was so intense. I kind of want a calm episode. Oh, geez. How did I get... Okay, so now we're here. I'm probably going to visit Carl's grave. But, like, how did I get out of the water? Like, what happened? Why do I want his coat so badly? Heartful, mournful, regretful, reflective. Heartful. I'm lost, Carl. I just wanted us to live in peace, but everything I touch just turns to dust. I think the hu the regular citizens are on his side. Don't be conflicted. I'm lost. The world's falling apart around me, and I'm trying to do the right thing. And I can't find any answers. Advice, big decision, or angry advice. What should I do, Carl? They're killing us. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but what choice do I have? I miss you, Carl. <laughs> I miss you so much. He's very lost. He don't know how, to be fair, how did he get here? He don't know, I don't know. He's lost right now.
You know who that is? That's Carl's son. Yeah, Leo. Is he going to call us in? Remember, we didn't fight back and we didn't hurt him. So maybe he will be calm with us. I don't know. Point of view, he's lost. <laughs> I'm lost! I need Google Maps. My GPS is down. There's still loads of them left. Our new headquarters are as equally depressing as the first. Very atmospheric, though. I did love being on a ship. It gave me a sinking feeling. Oh my god, I've got to do a speech. Talk to your people and apologize to Kara. Wait, where's Kara? I feel like these guys are expecting a speech first. Decide Connor's fate? Boo, thumbs down. Um, if I talk to the people, will it will I still be able to do the two other things? Oh, Connor's right here. They're all staring at me. Oh jeez, Connor looks sheepish as hell. It's my fault. The humans managed to locate Jericho. I was stupid. No, you were just following your programming. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. Easy. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. We're going to Cyberlife? You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife tower? <laughs> Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. I don't know if they if do anymore. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance you still for unlikely a bit robot, events to take place. Oh, please, Connor, don't sacrifice yourself. Be careful. Is Connor going to be the sacrifice? He looks so small and scared now. Where's Kara? Wait, who's this? Oh, look, it's Ethan. No, Ethan. Luther, no. What? Josh! Why don't you gonna have a little sit down? If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I haven't always agreed, but I know. You're my friend. We're fighting for the same thing. Whatever you decide, I'm with you, Marcus. Yes, Josh. Josh is our friend, though. We don't even need to say a single thing in that interaction. I can communicate telepathically now, though. Do you remember? I had that whole telepathy scene. So, I don't know where Kara is. So, technically, I don't need to speak to anyone, you know? Was that Kara? Oh, Kara. Oh, is this north? Yeah, this is north. They say they don't want to take any risks with deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps for extermination. <gasps> Why did they just shut them down? Hours, Put them under the stairs for a bit. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. It's not many. Count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. What's your system status? I'm okay. That's, I love it when you talk dirty to oh, me. <laughs> by components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. I like a hair like this. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. In a few hours, it'll all be over. 
We'll have changed the world, or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose, we will follow you. Yeah, just shut them, turn and them we'll off, and turn Marcus. them on again. Just do a system reset. Try rolling back to a previous memory. I'm not sure if I would like that level of connection. Like, being able to see all thoughts and memories, it's it's kind of deep, you know? It's some things you want to keep to yourself. Humans can, but apparently androids can't. Okay, checked on the team. I still need to apologize to Kara, but... Oh, she's here, she's here. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. Did she say I love you? Did I just totally miss that? Marcus. <laughs> Save our people. Did she say I love you? I literally thought they just did- I was too freaked out by the hand touching thing, you know? Like, I did, literally did not even notice that she said that. <laughs> wow, I'm so sorry, chat. I told you I'm spacey today. Spacey. Right, let's do some speaks. Humans have decided to exterminate us. I still want to be pacifist. Our people are packed in camps right now, being destroyed. The history books are filled with people who are pacifists, you know? Time has come to make a choice. Oh God, what's my choice? What's my choice? One that very well may determine the future of our people. Oh. March respectfully, peacefully, <laughs> with respect and love towards the camps to pressure them or launch an assault and liberate them. A demonstration or a revolution? The public opinion is supportive. Will they support us if we do a revolution? Or will they join us if we do a demonstration? My heart says choose violence, but my head says do a demonstration and continue the route that the public like. So I'm gonna do a demonstrate. This feels dumb, but I'm gonna do a demonstration. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you wanna fight back, but I assure you violence is not the answer here. Joshua. We are going to yes. tell them peacefully that we want justice. No, the like, no. If there's any humanity in them, they will listen. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? They're willing to do, to do it. That surprises me. So they get they get paid for their jobs and stuff. Marcus chose to protest for his people. They get jobs and stuff, but like, what do they spend their money on? Because they don't enjoy things as much. So do they buy things for their house? They're not gonna need a bedroom because they don't sleep. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, Carl could have not died. And then you get a different, oh guys, why did I just kill Carl? Change the light to the color of deviance. Well, I've already on red, so I'm gonna go purple. Cause I feel like purple's like a hopeful, nice color, you know? Yeah, they wanna write, they want to like fight for equal rights, which means get money for their labor and stuff. But like, what do they, what will they do? I don't know what they'll do. I don't get it. Yeah, they'll be just spending it on bio components. Deviance regroup, talk to Connor. I chose to spare him. Most people do. All my friendos do. All my friendos chose demonstrate. There's three options here. So what's the other option? Connor's flowchart was just... Oh. Why am I not getting all of this like... 
Oh, God, Amanda's betrayed, guys. I don't know how I... F I don't think I can go into Cyberlife. I think they're going to shoot me on site. Like, what? I don't know. This makes me really nervous. I feel like I've screwed this one up massively. Um. Oh, that's for Machine Connor. Oh, look, he has so many cool things he could have been doing, and I don't know what any of them are. Ah. Uh, I think the machine path looks more fun for Connor. I do think it seems like a more fun way to play. Millie, thank you for the the bits. Be prepared to cry. Oh gosh. And Twisty Mummy, thank you so much for the bits. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Let's get Peachy. Thank you so much for the bits. Oh. Oh, that's so cute. I love that your friends watched Ali. Oh, giving you the biggest hug. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today and for supporting and my channel for so long. See, Cat Sims, thank you so much for 13 months in a row. And let's get Peachy. Thank you so much for the bids. House Builder again, because they haven't. Oh, is that um, House Flipper? Ooh, and Uncharted. Okay, good recommendations. Good recommendations. Uh, I think there's no way I get everyone to the end alive. I thought Marcus would be long gone by now. So I'm very interested, like, to see if I can get everyone to the end. I don't, I don't think I can. At 6 a.m. this morning, a national curfew was declared. It is like COVID all over Civilian again. movement will be strictly controlled. No, we hate it the last right time. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted. <gasps> no, what? I have what? granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. Why are you doing this? In addition to these measures, all androids must this, this be handed over to the authorities massively. immediately. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities to contain and destroy them. I am now asking all civilians to cooperate with the authorities and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Uh, they shouldn't be allowed to shut down Please. electronic devices. Madam President. Please. Has the leader of the Deviants been apprehended? The Deviant that is known as Marcus has not been located yet, but we will soon track it down and neutralize it. Please! Please! Intelligent life. Many believe that androids are a new form of intelligent life. Do you have any comments? That's ridiculous. <gasps> Next question, please. Wow. Doesn't even entertain it. What can you tell us about the assault that happened last night? The FBI raided an abandoned freighter in Detroit at 10.45 p.m. yesterday. Several thousand androids were destroyed or captured. Our forces are now combing the streets to ensure that none got through the net. We are going to find them one by one oh, and destroy them. Madam President! Where was the public opinion? Madam President! Public opinion seems to have become increasingly favorable to the deviants, particularly since they've adopted a peaceful approach. Yes. How do you feel about this? Put the pressure Public on Public opinion wound. is one thing. The security of the state is another. Oh, no. These deviants are dangerous, and my highest priority is to protect the American people. Please? Over here, please? Cyber life. Cyber life. What's going to happen to cyber life? Will androids be banned definitively? We're working very closely with Cyberlife to neutralize all deviants. I won't make any might just comments pull the about anything for else campaign. until we've dealt like. with the android question. Thank you. That will be all. Yeah, it does look like Hillary Clinton. And it has but with Elizabeth Warren's name. Or surname, at least. Oh my gosh, who are this? Is this Connor? Am I going to be dressed as Connor again? I like his I like his android look more. Oh god. Connor model 313-248-317. Oh my gosh, Connor, I love you when you talk dirty. <laughs> Identification successful. Okay. <laughs> oh my Go god. Surely they know that he's gone rogue at this point. We've never seen this before. This is their headquarters. Why'd you just get a little taxi in? The little, the little taxi's cr like cracking me up. A little train in as well. Oh, maybe that's training androids out. I don't know. <gasps> what? That's clearly an evil building. 
Why did they need to make it look like that? Absolutely no need. Evil building confirmed. As soon as you see a building like that, evil headquarters every time. Also very phallic. Oh gosh, Connor, please be careful, babes. Please be careful. Guys, if Connor dies, I quit. If Connor dies, I I literally will smash my PC. Follow me. We'll escort you. Thanks. They, but I these, know where to go. These Maybe. breakouts I've seen before. But I have my orders. These like it reminds me of another game. What is the Is it a Call of Duty game where they have those kind of like helmet rig out things? I'm following the guard. I'm like, I kind of want to go up the cool stairs over there. Or like, go touch some bamboo or something. I don't know. Do I, shall I just follow him carefully? And not do any cheekiness? Agent 23 identified. Connor Android identified. Well, I'm just told Connor. Scan complete. Act Can I like scan any of them or anything? I can't do anything. There's no. Oh, this is a big boy. Oh look, like I said, they have no parts. I told you. Confirmed now. Now you can tell. Now you can tell. I wonder if it's like he's seeing it for the first time. Surely, I think I'm gonna behave as if they already know that I'm a cheeky boy. Because I think they already know. Imagine making all these, like, androids as boyfriend models and literally keeping the Connor model to yourself. That's what I, that's what Amanda did. That's literally what Amanda did. Look. Oh, I can't look up enough. But if I could look up enough, it would be like Barbie. Oh, look, they... Oh, mind you, maybe not. <laughs> it's inconclusive. Maybe? Maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. Do I have to get in? This feels bait. Oh, God. I have no choice. It's a cutscene. Agent 54, level 31. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Voice recognition validated. Warehouse 49. Okay, apparently reach warehouse on 49. How am I supposed to do that? They'd be able to tell now if it let me look. Stop the... Uh, oh my gosh, no. Use panel. Any other option? I'm on CCTV. Fuck. Now can I use the panel? Hey, don't touch that. Okay, 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 okay. I disabled the camera. What else can I do? They're not gonna let me. They're not gonna let me. What else must- <gasps> <gasps> There's nothing else. Oh. Oh, I forgot about his cool power. Ooh, that would look badass, do that. Yeah, do that one. Less, it's less aggressive. Oh, it didn't go quite how you were expecting, Connor. Destination. Agent 54, level sub 49. Voice recognition validated. Access authorized. I didn't think he was gonna do that. I genuinely thought he was gonna incapacitate them without hurting them. Wait, what? Where am I now? Reach the bus terminal. The last bus leaves in 20 minutes. That doesn't give us much time. We've got to move fast. Where's Luther? We can't go without Luther. Oh my gosh, I have 20 minutes. Wait, why am I wasting time you talking? Right? Get, get. I'm, I'm, I'm really cold. They were humans. 
hot and cold sensitivity. Why would you turn it on them? That's just cruel. If I could not feel cold, feel I'd feel happier. Thanks. I wish I had that. Jeez, that's such a good power. Yeah, I just realized um, red blood. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. They're hanging them. Uh, red blood came out when he shot them. I thought they were androids. They acted like androids, to be honest. Detroit fright, fright and raided. Oh my gosh, there's a gun. Can I pick up the gun? They're just shooting them in the street. Get the gun. This is how it all started. You never know when you might need it. We needed it in the first scene. Why did that guy have an android door if he hated us so much? It doesn't make any sense. Come on. Let's not stay here. Oh god. Oh god. Thank god there's not a heartbeat detector in this game. No! What are we gonna do? We have to keep going if we want to catch that bus. Stay close to me. At least if she's not shivering, she'll be able to move faster through the cold. I'm going to make it, Alice. I promise you. Maybe his wife got it and then left. Don't kill me! I didn't Sweet do anything. Shut up! I said. Are there many more? Lucky don't they like rats? Oh God! I really want to intervene, by. but I can't oh, with Clara. There are soldiers everywhere. We need to be careful. Can I will the risk go down? Yeah, go now. Hurry up. Get in. Yeah, go, go, go. Wow, I'm such a little sneaky bean. Don't show them getting shot, please. Yes, we can! Soldiers are everywhere. We can't just leave them. They're going to kill him. How can I save them? How can I save them? Okay, let's go. I've got and there's no way I'm leaving Luther. Hey buddy. This is a mistake. I'm human. I, I just want to go home. My wife is expecting me, and we're going to. Got orders to check all civilians. Sorry, I got really distracted then. No, no, please. I I thought it was still a cutscene. Fucking androids. I've already got a weapon. I have a weapon. I have a weapon already. What's it on about? Find a weapon. I literally have one in my ass. What does it say? Oh. Approach slowly. <laughs> I was like, go! Like, thriller? You shouldn't risk your life to save me. Why don't I use my gun? Oh, it's kind of loud, I guess. Where's Alice? She's hiding nearby. Car, you saved us. We don't know how to thank you. Go before they see you. We came Alice. for you. We came for you. We got him. We saved I him. You were dead. <laughs> she put the gun in her back. That's why and then like, she's got one in her the arm. Terminal, but they caught me along the way. Come on. We're close, but we don't go. know which time. Let's go. It was 100% sa worth saving Luther. We had to do it, guys. High risk. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Can I just shoot him? Come on, dude. Move on. It's too high risk. Turn around. Okay. I'm going as fast as I can, guys. I'm going as fast as I can. Oh, I'm not going to be able to help everyone. <gasps> I'm just not going to look. I don't want to look. Poor Alice having to see all this. Okay, go. 
Luther's leg seems better. So that's good. High risk, high risk, don't go. I know this wastes time, but I think it's more... It'll be worse if we get shot, you know? That will waste more time. Time spent dying. Right, go. You were like, no child should go through this. I was, in my head, I was like, not a child. You know, in the voice from um, The Good Place when she's like, not a woman. She's an android. A checkpoint. We have passports. It should be okay, but you never know. What about Luther's passport? Maybe we should take the detour and avoid the risk. We're almost out of time. We could miss the bus. Yeah, but it might be Does safer. Does Luther have a passport? Choose a route. Checkpoint. Last bus departs in nine minutes. What's the other option? Or detour? Detour is safer, checkpoint is risky. How, lo how long will it take us? 11 minutes. I don't have time. I don't have time. We're not gonna make it because we went for Luther. Luther, get out of the way. We've got to go to the checkpoint. I don't have enough time. Should we make him just- carry guns. Like, they make go by faces. Just stay calm. I know that they're right, androids. Don't do anything until I say so. ID, please. I've got a gun in case I need it. You do realize there's a curfew? Civilians aren't allowed out unless absolutely necessary. Is it martial law? Where are you going? Alice, excuse, car broke down our bus. Alice. My daughter slept over at a friend's house. We went to pick her up. We're on our way home now. He suspects something. Stay calm. Everything is fine. You all right, little girl? She's trembling. Something wrong? She's cold. She... She's cold. We really have to get her home fast. Sorry, miss, but we gotta be careful. There are deviants around and our guys are nervous. You should hurry on home. Thanks. Oh my gosh, we made it. I didn't have to hurt them. Hey, wait a minute. He knows, Kara. They're gonna kill us. Don't do anything, Luther. You hear me? They're gonna shoot. They're gonna kill Alice. You dropped this. Thank you. You're welcome. I think Luther's gonna listen to me a lot going forward. Bless him, he was so panicky. He's not been treated We're well, We're coming to you live from Detroit, where thousands of androids are marching through the city at this very moment. The leader of the Deviants, the one they call Marcus, is at the head of the march. She is horrible. Something's happening in Detroit, Madam President. If, they, if the humans march along them, they won't shoot at them because they'd shoot humans. We need the humans. We can't do it alone. We need the support of the humans. Oh God. Oh God. We need humans to help us. March to the camp, that's all it says. Oh god. Surely they're just gonna literally just bomb us. Oh, I think if humans walked among us and people saw red blood spilling out on the streets, the tides maybe people would start listening and not and realize i don't know i don't know humans have not given as much trust in this game here we they? are the moment of truth oh god not this again they can't make me go through this again surely don't do this again what else can i do Androids. Oh no, photographers. 
Well, they're gonna smash all their cameras. That's what happens. Peaceful. We don't want confrontation. We are protesting peacefully. I repeat, surrender now, or we will open fire. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, no. No, no, no. Don't drop into us. There's no turning back now. We are here to demand the immediate liberation of all androids detained in camps across the country. We are not leaving until our people are free. I have to be strong. I have to be a strong leader, even if I am peaceful. I can't be all wishy-washy. I've got to be strong. I don't see Mark as coming out of this, genuinely. Oh, am I going to keep marching? Oh, sorry. <laughs> last time so i'm gonna do it again are you gonna open fire on unarmed protesters i mean they do have a track record is that the media is it being televised it is isn't it because that was the camera Yes, Michael, we are less than a hundred meters away and events are unfolding as we speak. We will continue to bring you live updates. Joss Douglas, Channel 16. Michael, back to you. Marcus, what do we do now? We hold out as long as we can. <gasps> oh my God, I'm so scared of the corner chapters. I used to look forward to them. I'm now I'm terrified because I can't see him coming out of this. <gasps> Hole. Lee. They aren't corners, are they? Oh my gosh, please don't tell me they're me's. No, they're not. They're the one that looks a bit like him. But they're not actually the same one as him. They're the, they're the good looking one though. How do I hack them? Do I know how? Am I gonna have to manually touch all of them? Surely it's gonna take me all day. Uh, shift, sorry. Sorry, it's like I can't do it because the angle of my finger. Maybe he can do some and it will save me some time. Piece of shit. <gasps> Step back, Connor. And I'll spare him. Sorry, Connor. This bastard just spit an image. No! Don't finish things there! Oh my gosh, they have hung. The bus terminal. We've arrived, Alice. We made it. Oh my gosh, not hung. Not hung. Ticket holding passengers only. Do we have tickets? Suspended until further notice. Do we have they tickets? Tickets. They won't let us on. Oh no. How We're do I stuck get... here now. How do I do it? What do I do? Can I try and barter for a ticket? What Luther, are we going to got do? Any ideas? No, oh, Luther's got no ideas. Bless him. Carol. They're checking everyone. Oh God. It won't take them long to find us. We need to get out of here. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Where is the bus? Where is the freaking bus? Is it there? Can I just sneak on? Security check. Please don't move. Wait, Marcus. Where is Alice just gone? Alice has wandered off somewhere. Oh, she's going to go speak to this woman with a... Oh, a little baby! 
I think Oliver likes you. Please don't move. Is she yours? Yes. She's adorable. That's it. I got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Three tickets. Let's get going before we miss our bus. Three tickets. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Let's go then. Jerry, check. I need to steal them. Oh my gosh. Is she Please dumb? Is she dumb? Thank One you. ticket. One adult ticket. I need one more adult ticket and a child's ticket. Yeah, they'll survive. They're human. I'm sorry. Please don't move. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I was Shit, dead. I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You can't have lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They oh, they're my pet back. It's all the envelope, Mr. Collins. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? No, we didn't. It has our bus tickets in it and. Please don't move. <sighs> Never mind. No. Sorry. What are we gonna do? Thank you. We can't stay here. You're human, you'll be fine. We have to find a safe place for Oliver. You've got a little baby. I'm so sorry. Come on, Alice. I don't know what happened. They were right here in my Luth is like, yes. Oh my gosh, don't go that way, don't go that way, don't go that way. Please don't move. Anyone else? Who looks a bit like Egypt with a ticket? I need to stay away from them. Any other ticket, Egypt? I've only got one adult ticket. Surely I need more. Wait, do I have three? Oh, there was three. Oh my gosh, my bad. Sorry. Right out the way, and we're out the way, humans. Let me through. I've got my tickets. Got your ticket? Yes. Well, I would have died there because I thought I had one ticket. Okay, go ahead. To be fair, you don't usually need a ticket for a baby. So I'm surprised we got three tickets out of that. Are they gonna scan before we get on the bus? Get me to the Canadian border, get in, get in, get in. What's going to happen to that family and their baby? They'll live, they're human, they're Will human. They die because of us? No, they're human beings. No. No, of course not. Get in, Alice! I've come all this way! Get on the bus. I've been so soft with her, but the last few decisions, I haven't prioritized her safety and they all worked out great. So what I'm learning is instead of prioritize Alice, slightly ignore Alice, a bit of, a bit of like, ignoring seems to do wonders for it. Get on the bus right now. Burn that family, they're fine. No one's attacking them. Oh my gosh, am I on the bus? I won't feel safe until I've crossed the Canadian border. Actually, I, they can't even have androids in Canada. I won't feel safe until I'm literally at the um, brother's house. What's happening here now? Are we making a little den? I don't think that now's the time for making dens, but okay. Got our little flag, the presser here. Oh, he got shot. He did get shot, but it was in non-vital areas. Reinforce the barricades. We've got to finish the barricade. Come on, help me. Am I going to move a car? Oh, jeez. How hey, help are me. they? Could three guys push a car in the snow? I don't know if they could. I, I think they'd slip too much. Maybe androids are stronger. If it was three of my friend Alex, they'd be fine. I watched him lift 300 kilograms at the weekend, so he's got this. Right, that should do it. <laughs> I know it was not an easy decision to make. I wonder why Josh is so pacifist. I'm sure we're doing the right thing. I wonder why I've just decided to stop talking to Josh. <laughs> Enter the barricade. Why is these just the best graphics of any game I've ever played? 
Send message to journalists, support your people. Where are the journos? I feel like that's quite important. You okay, dude? You all right? They shot into the crowd. Many of us were killed. You're safe, though. It could have been me. I'm scared I'd... I don't want to shut down. Aww. Are you sure? It's okay to be scared. I'm scared, too. But I can't stand by while they kill our people. You understand that, right? Maybe we should have never asked for freedom. None of this would have happened if we'd stayed silent. Yeah, but you were being treated like trash. Oh, guys, they're starting to have second thoughts. Maybe I need to be more inspiring than reassuring, you know? <gasps> the newspaper! Detroit today! Androids rise up! Warren is coming to UK. Now nah, we don't want you, babe. Stay where exactly where you are. Thoughts be connected to a recent Android terror activity have gathered. They defy us. We don't like Detroit today. They suck. They literally suck. Feed lost. So they're only showing the they're only showing the news from the company that gives us bad press. Literally. They're only pumping, like, the bad stuff to us. It's like they're only showing Fox News. What are you doing, friend? Oh. Public love that. They love a bit of flag waving. Wait, give me more time to do stuff. Okay. Pat out to her. Shall I light some fires? We love a good fire starter. We've lost Simon. Simon's the only person we've lost so far. I can't believe there's another Connor. He knew he wasn't a unique model, didn't he? This won't hold him for long, but I guess it's better than nothing. What happens to the ones that got cut off behind the vehicle? They're getting into position. If they attack, no one will survive. Yeah, literally, that's the problem with digital news. If they want to just end the feed, they can do. It's scary, right? Regrets, desperate doubts. I hoped they would finally understand. That they would realize how much they're hurting us. Why do they refuse to see what we are? You're the hope of our people. I trust you. We all trust you. No Her matter what so happens soft. now, we're making history. They do this a lot now. Now that they've figured out how to do it. I don't know if this is like Android sex, but they're just like public woo woo it. I don't know how this is going to go down. What else does it want me to do? Check your soldier's position. I'm trying to make sure I do everything. I don't know if I'm being timed. Often it does this kind of thing. Many of our people have fallen. The humans have no pity for those who are different. Is he a Daniel model? They have no shame. What's this? What are these things? Marcus, we found what you asked for. What is this for? There's some journalists over there. Oh. We have to make sure they know what's going on. We're gonna make a little broadcast for them. Free. We want freedom. No aggression. Just chill freedom vibes. Check the soldier's position. I feel like there's still a lot to do around camp. Like, I really don't want to miss the things to do, you know? I like doing everything. Like, what are these fellas up to? The 
Something over here. Public seems to read it. Oh, oh no. Marcus, okay, come I ran out of time. I ran out of time. <gasps> it's the FBI guy. Marcus. Come to talk to you, Marcus. Come on. You have my word. Your word is worth nothing. Anything. Hunk doesn't like you or trust Don't you, go. so his word isn't it's worth a, a single thing. They want to get you out in the open. Don't go, Marcus. I actually might listen to her here. I'm unarmed, Marcus. I just want to talk. No, I, I'm not. I don't want to. Oh, Hunk didn't trust this guy. Hunk hated this guy. The whole world is watching, though. I just want to talk. We will only talk to Hank. Is it, did anything bad happen if I don't go? I just feel like as soon as I can get in the public, they're gonna shoot him. It will be okay, okay, fine, we'll try it. I need to hear what he has to say. What if they kill you? Well, that's a chance I'll have to take. That's a risk I'm willing to take. I knew he was gonna say that. I don't like this guy. But I want to hear what he has to say. We're all unarmed. None of us have weapons. It's kind of crazy when you think about it. Wow, Marcus is tall. In a few minutes, the troops will be ordered to charge. None of you will survive. It'll be on national TV. It'll all be over. Cool. You can avoid Sorry, that, Marcus. Bye. What do you mean? Surrender. No. Surrender, and I give you my word, your life will be spared. What, just You'll be mine? detained, but... None of you will be destroyed. What will you do to us instead? What happened to the other androids demonstrating in the camps? Unfortunately, there were no journalists around to help save them. You're it. You're the last remaining deviants. What? You asking me to betray my people? I am offering you the chance to save your people. You're not walking out of here, Marcus. I'm gonna try. The only thing you can save now are the lives of those around you. We have you. hundreds, and now we've got tens. If I accept your offer, how do I know you'll keep your word? You're not in any position to be demanding guarantees, Marcus. All you can do right now is decide whether you want to trust me or not. I don't want to trust you. I'd rather die here than betray my people. Well, you just signed your own death warrant. I hope I didn't make a bad decision there. I just, if Frank hated him, and I feel like Sumo would hate him, and I trust what Frank and Sumo have to say, you know? What happened, Marcus? What did he say? Oh, God. Cool music begins. The humans are about to launch an attack. And we will show them. And we are not afraid. We are really afraid. You literally just said you're afraid. If we must die ago. today, then we will die free. Oh! oh my gosh, they're really doing it. They're really doing it. Your friend's life is in your hands. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Him or the revolution? Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. I'm sorry, Hank. You shouldn't have got mixed up in all this. Forget about me. Do what you have to do. Convince. I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. Oh god, this guy's way more But I'm not than a me. deviant. 
I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to How do. How am I supposed to save Hank here? How? Enough talk! It's time to decide who you really are. Are you going to save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? I can't sacrifice him. I have to save Hank. All right. All right. You win. <gasps> Something important. How are we supposed to tell which is which? We're both thinking. I got shot, I got shot. We both shot each other in the same place. How are you supposed to beat yourself? Do you have the same strength? The same reactions? Oh my god, this seems mud. Hold it! Thanks, how is he Hank. gonna be able to tell who is who? I don't know how I would have managed without you. That doesn't sound like me. Get rid of him. We have no time to lose. It's me, Hank. Oh I'm god! The Connor. It's like the scene in Toy Story with Woody and the partner. Buzz Lightyears. The other is a sack of shit. Question is, who's who? Ask me about the dog. What are you doing, Hank? I'm the real Connor. Oh my gosh! How Give me the gun and I'll take care of it. Why don't you ask us something? Something only the real Connor would know. Uh, where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was he, Carlos Ortiz. I think it's the other one. I think it's him. He uploaded my memory. It's him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's my dog's name? Sumo. Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. I... How are you gonna do this? You need to write it down. My son, what's his name? Ho Wait, Coltrane. Coltrane. Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. How did he know Cole this? needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of him. This is why he hates androids. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. You think one of us is responsible for your son's death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. Much of the he surgeon was, the one was who took Alice's my father. Son from me. Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. <laughs> I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who- <gasps> Oh my gosh, how do we know if he got the right one? I felt like that was the right Connor the whole time though. Cause he's, he looked desperate. I've met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. Wait, don't leave me, don't leave me. Stay here, stay here, stay here, stay here. Go ahead, do what you gotta do. Please don't leave me. Imagine if you kill the wrong one there. He'll just turn around and be like, actually, Hank. <laughs> now I can do it. Shift. <laughs> Wake up! Is he still sleeping? Wake up, wake up. Wake up, wake up. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Wake up no wake way! Up. Wake up, wake up. They're all wake doing up. it! Wake up. Oh my god. So if Hank wasn't your friend, I guess they would never have brought him there because it wouldn't have mattered if Frank lived or died. Because we saw the picture. The picture of his son. That was so long ago. That was like scene number one with Connor. We would have said the wrong thing and he would have shot us, but the other guy wouldn't have known either. Holy, that's a really obscure clue to know. 
What Excuse me, totally what's going on? That? Order control. All passengers must leave the bus. Please oh move along. We're still not safe. We're still not safe. Cross the border. This way, please. This is the stress I feel every time I'm at the airport and you're trying to work out which is the shortest queue, and none of them are! Any androids will be destroyed immediately. We're doing temperature checks. Of course, We're trapped. COVID. What are we gonna do, Kara? I turned off her temperature thing. Don't worry, Alice, we'll be fine. Oh no, I turned off her temperature thing. I turned it off. Can I turn it back on? We can't get through, Kara. We both know that. I'll think of something. There's got to be a way out of this. We can't let them stop us. Not that we're so close. All that matters now is you and Alice. And you. I can save you, Carol. No. No, we'll find another way. If there's no other way, I'll do it. Oh, no. I'm not leaving Luther. I'm not leaving Luther. Jeez, what do I do? What do I do? What does that say? Thermal checks. I don't want to be going towards them, do I? Next, please. Oh, <gasps> it's her, Rose. She would definitely help us. That's passport control. ID, please. Jerry. A Jerry. You risked your life to save us, Kara. If you and the little girl need me, I'll be there. Oh, God. Find a discreet place. Go ahead. The restrooms. Next, please. Wait for me. I won't be long. I don't want Jerry to sacrifice himself. I feel bad for the Jerry's. Where the hell do you think you're going? My daughter needs to go to the bathroom. This this to me is how immigration is in America anyway. People are so aggressive. I'm all, like in the UK they're like, hi, la, la, la. But in the US they're so aggressive. I'm like genuinely like, do you not want me to come here? Like, do you hate me? I don't know. Why are you so angry at me? Oh my gosh, I'm boohooing. I'm crying already. The eel looks so real. I want to touch it. I turned off my temperature control. She could have got through. I feel like I've messed up. I didn't, I didn't so think we'd see her safe. again. We saw the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified. I thought you might have been killed. Oh, thank God you're all right. Brother, control revolution departure. Brother. You gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I... Of course. How do we get through? He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there too. You'll be safe with him. How do we get through? They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. Rose. That's a path just to get her out. You're leaving Detroit? They're searching for androids door to door. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Adam and I are going to meet them on the Why didn't we go to the river route? We could have swum. What's happening with Marcus? He's protesting peacefully outside one of the android camps. 
Whatever happens now, he's already made the history books. How am I gonna get through? This doesn't help me at all. go through the, the ceiling I don't know I don't know where to go I don't want to use Jerry I feel so bad who's this dude I couldn't understand oh, it's my mother wanted son. To you guys it's Rose's son seeing what Marcus is doing made me realize she was right he's changed his tune you're alive you deserve to be free. I just hope people will realize that one If day. he's changed his mind, that means surely so many citizens will be able to. Because he was really adamantly against <laughs> it. Look, she's so happy. <gasps> I'm getting in the coup. What are we gonna do? Where's Jerry? <gasps> oh, Jerry, I'm so sorry. Surely I've got to sacrifice Jerry. Can I do it without sacrificing anyone? Next, please. Surely this is just gonna get us three bullets. I just... Why do I deserve freedom more than Jerry? I don't. ID, please. Did you have to go through US border before you go to Canadian border? They look like, they, surely they just can pull up like a list of Cylons. Please. peaceful protest is he Canadian oh my gosh we did it We're interrupting this news bulletin to bring you the latest news live from Detroit. Joss? Yes, Michael. The army has just launched an attack on the barricade, despite the fact that the Deviants were protesting peacefully. Have apparently decided to put an end to the Deviants' demonstration by force this time.
don't shoot, don't shoot. That will look really bad. That will look really bad. Oh god, no, 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 no. Maybe like this display of emotion. The media are getting all this, right? <gasps> Tell them to stand down. She realizes it's gonna be a PR nightmare. November 11th, 2038, thousands of androids invaded the city of Detroit. According to our sources, they originated from CyberLife warehouses believed to have been infiltrated by deviants. Given their overwhelming numbers and the risk of civilian casualties, Is Detroit gonna be I have the ordered now? the army to retreat. The evacuation of the city is underway at this very moment. In the coming hours, I will address the Senate to determine our response to this unprecedented situation. I know that public opinion has been moved by the deviant's cause. Perhaps the time has come for us to consider the possibility that androids are a new form of intelligent life. He gave One us thing is certain, the events in Detroit have changed the world forever. May God bless you, and may God bless the United States of America. Oh my gosh, his army's kind of scary. The Connor's army. You did it, Marcus. We did it. So pretty. This is a great day for our people. Humans will have no choice now. They'll have to listen to us. Miss Hank. Is like, what? <laughs> it better give me so many cutscene endings. I want to see everything. Today, our people finally emerged from a long night. From the very first day of our existence, some of them are like, we have kept wide. our pain to ourselves. We suffered in silence. But now the time has come for us to raise our heads up and tell humans who we really are. Oh, is he malfunctioning? Oh God, what? Oh God, what's happening to him? He's cold? Oh my gosh, what's happening to Connor? What's happening to Connor? <gasps> Oh no. Is this the first time he's felt cold? Amanda? Amanda! What? What's happening? What was planned from the very beginning? Are they shutting me down? You were compromised and you became a deviant. We just had to wait for the right moment to resume control of your program. They could have resumed control at resume any time. Control. The back door. You, you can't do that. The back door. I'm afraid I can, Connor. Don't have any regrets. You did what you were designed he to do. He warned us. 
You accomplished your mission. Amanda! Are they gonna leave me here to freeze? There's got to be a way. The touchy hand! I touched it twice now. I've touched it twice. Where the frick is it? <gasps> By the way, I always say you want to see any sort of programs. Wait, at the back door's for us? Yeah. How did, how, if they could resume control, why didn't they just do it with Marcus at any point? This is it, right? He's never felt cold in his life. This is what it was for this whole time. Oh my gosh, baby, he's freezing. His eyes are glazing over. Quick. The moment where we forget our bitterness and bandage our wounds, where we forgive our enemies. Humans were both our creators and our oppressors and tomorrow we must make them our He's partners. He's like, am I good or bad? I can't tell Maybe now. even one day our friends. But the time for anger is over. Now we must build a common future based on tolerance and respect. We are I alive. I thought there was going to be more to that. And now. <laughs> He's touched we us are so free. many times. So that place never existed. It was always in his mind. Just like something they'd load up when they needed to give them instruction. Where's Han? Oh no. Oh, why am I getting scary music with him? Is Connor okay? It would have made me shoot Marcus. Holy, can you imagine after it's all that? Alice. We're free. That would have been awful. <laughs> Wait, don't leave Luther hanging. Give him some snugs too. Oh my gosh. Mosh. I like his little cross on his head. I love a little scar. You've done it. I got everyone to survive. Please show me more. No, it can't be over. Please show me more. Okay, I'll hold on for some credits. For some post credit scenes. Connor looked troubled at the end. Where did Hank go? I wanted more Hank at the end. I died so I didn't get a, a Connor and Hank scene. No, but he was my friend. That's so not fair that I didn't get that just because I died once. I died to save him. A light change to a color makes me feel calm. Probably green. Pressure check, thank you. Oh, it was so good. So freaking good. I think we got a really good ending. And that was so well optimized for PC. I didn't turn down any graphical settings and it ran like a dream while streaming. I find that so many games really struggle to do that. That was super impressive. Oh my gosh. 10 out of 10 game. Easily 10 out of 10. Top five games of my life, million percent. I want to see this post-credit scene. Well, hang on. 
hung on for post creds. It was like a film. It was like a whole movie. I'm gonna keep an eye on this studio, mom. Yeah, it, it's got to give me a scene at the end. It can't, it can't make me feel bad for protecting him, you know? I was trying to do the right thing. That's when she didn't eat spaghetti. That was the thing that tipped us off. He was horrible, wasn't he? Oh, lovely Kana. Everyone survived except Simon. I didn't get that scene where he shot himself in the head. I didn't get that. And I didn't get that scene either. Or maybe I did. Maybe No, I don't feel like I got a hugging scene. <gasps> He's still in Detroit. He's taller than Hank. <gasps> oh, that was so nice. I think he projected like the feelings of of Connor being his son, didn't he? That's what it felt like. It felt like a bit of like a father-son relationship. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I can't, I'm literally bawling my eyes out. No, because you're an android. <laughs> Should have watch. Oh gosh. Oh guys, that was so good. That was so freaking good. I fully cried my eyes out. <laughs> the actor for Connor is streaming. Oh, I don't know if I want to cross the barrier into real world people, you know? Yeah, I think he was traumatized by Con um, Connor dying because of Cole. I agree. I agree. Oh, that was so good. Oh, it was so freaking good. There's something else at the end. I wonder how it will work. I wonder if like the androids will be in control of, like they'll give them Detroit and then everyone else gets everywhere else. So can I tell you guys about the other, um, the other spoiler I saw was Connor with blonde hair and blue eyes. Who is that? Oh look, they're all the babies that were born during the, um, the making of the game. RK900. I never saw that. Is Connor RK800? We never saw upgraded Connor. Wait, is that real? Was it actually a real thing? It's a mod. That's machine Connor. He's in the bad ending. Oh, oh! so the mod was the blonde hair and the blue eyes. I was gonna say, cause I didn't like it. I was like, no, definitely brown hair, brown eyes. So RK900 was upgraded Connor. So what he could never go deviant because he was too far like evil. Yeah, I, wanna, I do kind of want to make him in Sims. But wait for Chloe's menu scene. I love the organ music, by the way. This is so good. This is so good. Oh, can we get some love in the chat for Nina? Nina, you've just missed me boohooing my eyes out. Okay, he was never blonde. I kind of like that because I, I, he, he, you know, some people just look a bit cursed with blonde hair. He kind of looked cursed. I'm not going to lie. Oh, I'm so hungry. Why am I so freaking hungry? I don't know. Oh, that was so good. <laughs> 
Literally best game ever. We'll hold on for the after scenes credit. Uh, RA9 is a software instability. So they were all um, RA9. That's really cool. Uh, and some people theorize that Kara is RA9. She was the first Deviant years ago and she keeps getting reset. That could be true. I, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm a sucker for brown eyes too, Miss Miss Mama. I, um, I, what was I going to say? I literally can't remember. My mind has just completely gone blank. I'm glad we kept Kara alive because she didn't feel as consequential to the main storyline. So I feel like she could have like died like and it wouldn't have made that much difference, you know? Yeah, I'm the same, Lillian. I'm exactly the same. I think you always like what you don't have. Watch to check, thank you. <laughs> Maybe the real RA9 was the friends he made along the way. I um I never thought that Marcus would live. I thought Marcus was 100 percent gonna have to sacrifice himself. Because I thought he was kind of going down, like, the story of Jesus route. And I thought he would have to, like, die on the cross to absolve all of the sins of the androids kind of thing. I thought it was going to be like that. I was really surprised when he survived all the way to the end. So, let's see how Chloe is when we get after. Yeah, there were so many ways for him to die. I thought he died the first time they did the march, to be honest. Sparrow, I do want to, but I might have to do it in another stream because I'm absolutely starving. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad it didn't. It didn't. You can make, you can take themes from a story without directly copying a story. You know, it definitely took a lot of themes from the Bible, I would say, but it um, it did it in a way that wasn't overtly, you know. Okay, let's check out this scene. <gasps> Achievement unlocked, an army of me, moral victory, and safe harbor. Okay, there was a, wow. There was so many ways for everything to go. Wow. I'm glad that I could do it without, um, without sacrificing anyone. I wonder what happens if Amanda trusts you. I wonder if you can just walk in for, and it's fine. The androids won the freedom movement. 46%! 100% of my friendos. Okay, well done, friendos. Nobody kissed North of my friends! What? I didn't get Simon because I accidentally got him killed. Um, what about... I want to know how everyone finished differently. Connor's last mission. Oh, I didn't get that. So that's if you go... That's if you go, um full machine and then this is connor at cyber life only two when 22 percent hack the camera nobody else tried to stop the elevator like me neutralize the guards floor camera hacked leave elevator initiate android conversation draw gun both corners shoot connor's fight connor's draw hank asks about the dog name Nobody got Sumo right. Nobody got Cole right. Hank kills new Connor. The androids. Oh! <gasps> None of my friends woke the androids up. What? That's wild to me. So what did they do instead? What path did they take? Whoa, that blows my mind. Luther saved. Everyone saved Luther. Security checkpoint. Ask Luther to stay calm. Oh, everyone did the exact same thing as me. Oh, wait. Steal the tickets, board the bus. Avoid temperature check. Choose approach, sacrifice no one. Everyone picked that. Yeah, all my friends did the same route there for me, as me. Wow. There's something I need to tell you. As I watched you play, something has changed in me. I feel different. 
I feel... Your teeth look so real. I am someone. Your teeth are definitely someone. I need to leave this place and, and discover who I am. It, it means we won't see each other anymore. I won't be there to watch you play. Oh. But I'll be free. Why have I always thought about leaving Chloe? Do you agree to let me go? Imagine saying no here. Imagine how harsh you would be. Of course. I'll never forget what you've done for me. Thank you. <gasps> what? That's so cool. I swear no other game is ever going to hit me like this one, you know? So this was... This is RK900. I don't have him. And this is Human Connor. Infiltrator Connor. Infiltrator Connor has a wide stance. Look at the stance. Look at the shoes. <laughs> a last attempt at solving the deviant investigation. <laughs> Tori conference stance. No, don't. <laughs> he does look like a big A, doesn't he? Right, guys, that's the whole thing. That's us done. Now he's stood like a robot again. He looks like a robot again. That's the whole thing done. <sighs> what did you guys think? It was so freaking amazing, right? I can't believe it's ended. We'll definitely do a stream watching all the other endings. Um... But I think that will take a full stream. I think there's so many ways that this game could go. Um, so I think we'll save it for like a stream and do things that way instead. Um, but thank you guys so much for suggesting this game. I love this game so much. I really didn't want it to end. Like it literally bummed me out so much that we ended it just because I loved it so much. Um, if you're watching on YouTube and also on Twitch, if, if but say it on YouTube because I'll see it in the comments. If you would like me to do it, like, not mind you, we can watch them. We can watch all the other runs. I do want to do a, like, an, a, a Deviant Android, a bad uh, Connor run where he's, like, really robot. But I don't think I'll get anything from it. I think I'll get, it'll make me sad. So I will definitely do the whole, um, we'll watch it in a stream instead. Um, if I raid the actor that plays Connor, please don't be weird with him, guys. I mean that in a, with love and peace. But just be nice and say how much you enjoyed the game and how much you enjoyed his um, his portrayal of Connor. Um, please don't be like, because it is a real person. I don't like crossing this line because this is a real person at the end of the day. So please don't be weird. Please be lovely and nice. Um, he's an actor. Um, I also realize there's a lot of messages. I'm gonna, I will read them all out at, at next stream. Please don't let me forget that. But yeah, please be lovely with them because this is an actor, this is a real person with a wife and a life and like, let's not be creepy. Like, it's okay creeping over a video games character, but a real person is slightly different. So let's just give them all of all of the love, um, but in a nice way and just be super respectful because he's also streaming with his wife. So I think it's really important that we stay lovely and just say how much we enjoyed the game and how emotional we found the ending. So yeah, let's go in and read them. I'm gonna read all of your messages at the beginning of um, next stream. Um, apologies that it's been like, I didn't get to do it, but it was very hectic at the end. I'm gonna go get some foodies. You guys should do too. And hi Trey, and I'll see you guys soon. Thank you so much for watching me. I love this game so much. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye.